it's like a survival game. Franklin senior John Limbert says it's all the rage. If you get hit with the water gun, you're out of the game. But only if your clothes get wet. If your clothes get wet, you're out. Explain. Yeah, if your clothes get wet, you're out. But if you're naked? If you're naked, you're still in. 12 News obtained photos from last year's game. It's a team sport called paranoia, and kids use brackets like those in the NCAA. There's a big prize at the end, too. What's the prize? Uh, it's like some, like, it's like an Amazon gift card, like a $100 gift card. This morning, Franklin Police posted this warning on its Facebook page, saying the game has sparked complaints of reckless driving, prowling, trespassing, and public nudity. Police say a driver called them early this morning to say he'd spotted kids jumping in and out of a car naked near this subdivision in Franklin. Police ticketed two Franklin High School boys and a girl. Molly Thiel says the incident is all the talk on neighborhood social media. I see a mix of people thinking it's hysterical and others worried that it's just going to create more reason for people to sneak around at night and get involved in things I shouldn't be. So. You know the police aren't happy about this. Are you serious? They arrested three kids this morning. For what? For being naked? Disorderly conduct. For? 375 bucks. Ah. Oh. <laughs> well, they're not catching me. I'm out. They could have caught me, but. John Limbert says he's no longer playing paranoia because he got caught with his clothes on. In Franklin, Colleen Henry, WISN 12 News. Franklin police remind students and parents the game is not sanctioned by the high school.